are here with me on our stage out at Bartlett Farm. Um, we have constructed a 40 by 24 foot stage to bring people back to theater. But then also to bring a little bit of joy, I think, to the island, we, um, we decided we'd bring Mamma Mia back, um, which was such a hit uh, in 2017. And coupled with that, we're celebrating our 65th anniversary, so it, I thought it'd be nice to do, you know, something new, something older, a nod back to the classics. So we're going to present A Grand Night for Singing, which is a Rodgers and Hammerstein review that will um, run in rep throughout the summer out here under the stars. <laughs> So we're very fortunate, I, I feel, I'm selfishly, to have Andrew Graham here. He happens to be my husband, but he also happens to be a Broadway conductor. He's headed to do Moulin Rouge in, uh, in January. But um, we have him here for uh, Mamma Mia and for a grand night for singing. Mamma Mia is going to sound just like you want it to sound. We've got a new set of electric drums. It's very exciting. And then even more exciting, though, um, on a grand night for singing, um, some of our local favorite musicians will be joining us. Nigel Goss, Molly Glazer, um, Isaiah. So I think it should just be a beautiful experience and, and two very different experiences in the same location. You know, this is the first time in my eight years as artistic director here that I've felt um, a real sense of community. I mean, certainly we've collaborated with organizations and, and we work together, but I mean, this feels like the community came together to make this happen. Bartlett's Farm has been just incredible in, in their generosity. Marine Home has helped fund this entire stage, which is just huge. I, I, I can't go without mentioning, we have I think one of the most supportive boards. I mean, when Bethany Oliver and I said, let's do this, they didn't hesitate. They just were like, great, how do we, let's, how do we do it? What do you need? I mean, talk about a community coming together and Bartlett just letting us be here in their backyard. Um, I just think that this is the epitome of a community pulling together after a really really trying time and it shows. My name is Sarah Fraunfelder and I play Tanya. It is love on stage. It is all about connecting. It is all about family and chosen family and real family and people coming together and it is just a beautiful, beautiful story. It's impossible not to fall in love with it. It's a full of heart, I think also empowering story about a young woman finding herself and her mother kind of reinventing herself and finding herself yet again. So it, they, um, you know, over the course of, of two hours and I think about 17 ABBA hits, um, I think it warms your heart and it also takes you on a journey that you're, that's a little bit unexpected. Um, and um, and I, think, I think everybody, leaves having seen a little bit of themselves on the stage, which is why I think they connect so well to the, the story. I don't care if you've slept with hundreds of men. You're my mother and I love you. Oh, Sophie. <laughs> I haven't slept with hundreds of men. I do, I do, I do.